Good morning, everybody. Afternoon, evening, wherever you are. Today's video is a continuous of yesterday. I ended it kind of on a cliffhanger that uh, life as we know it is going to change. This is based off the video from yesterday. I will make sure I put a card or a link or something in the comments or in the description box. You'll find it somewhere to yesterday's video. And it was about, you know, all the corruption in our justice system. Well, the reading ended of this was going to be change life as we know it. Coming up real soon. Saw a female president potentially. Potentially. As I like to say, the future is mutable. It can change. The only thing guaranteed in life is your birth, taxes, and death. Disclaimer notice, this video is for entertainment purposes only. All information in this video is not based on fact. It is all alleged, based upon my intuition, my opinion, what I believe my tarot cards are telling me. I encourage each and every one of you to do your own research, form your own opinions. After all, I'm just a blonde throwing cards. Okay, let's get into it. Before we get into it, the tarot deck that I am using it was from 1973. The box is pretty well beat up, but I've kept it because this is a very, very old deck. It was by a Russian artist. I, th I was going through my decks and I had come across this. I brought it upstairs. It was actually downstairs still. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> and the future <clears throat> of our world and life as we know it. When I brought it upstairs, it was sitting on my desk. I went to put it away and it spoke to me. It says, no, use me in your next reading. And I knew that this was going to be my next reading. It's called a Egorov Tarot. I cannot pronounce it. Um, this deck, deck was actually redone in 1982. And Planet Queen. But he was a Russian artist. And like I said, originally 1975. Okay, very old deck, not in print. Um, when I got this, I got this probably 20 years ago. I haven't used it very uh, much, but I got it. All, I had. I, got, I think I got it from eBay, and because it's out of print. I got it at a reasonable price. I don't even know how how much it is. It is like a very rare. This is a very rare tarot deck. So I'm going to start off with the tarot 
Then I'm going to get into the Whispers of the Unknown, which is um, Ashley's deck from the Reckoning Co. I will bring my deck out again when I get the new set in because there were modifications to it to my um, True Crime Investigations Oracle because I added 10 cards. So it is actually, and everybody that ordered is actually going to get, instead of 140 cards, you're going to get 150. Okay, I kind of modified it a little bit. Ashley's deck is 180. But, and I still will have, I still have, I, I sold one copy. I still have nine spare copies that will be left over when I get my shipment available for purchase on my website. Okay. Now we got that whole spiel over with. Okay. See if we can get some energy. What it does it what did you mean, Spirit, when you said life as we know it is going to change? What did you mean by life as we know it is going to change? Ooh, chariot in the reverse with the three of coins in the reverse. Any forward progress that we as a nation, or maybe even as the world, any forward progress that had been made, this is a complete stop. No longer working together. I almost get the image of conflicts coming up. And it's going to take center stage, the star. So there's unex there is conflicts that we may not have expected coming to the forefront here that we may not have been seeing coming. And we need to start looking at the bigger picture. And the star card, I'm looking at all the stars, the universe. This is universal. This is not just the United States, folks. Not just the United States is being effect that's going to be affected. This is feeling very global. The sun. Exposure. Something coming to light. Um, the sun, I don't know why I'm hearing it, but I'm hearing solar flares, um, solar storms, maybe, or things being blamed on solar storms. That's interesting. But the sun is an exposure. What are they exposing? Eight of swords. That's the nightmare. That's the, um, overthinking, being caught in the head, even imprisonment. And that's also anxiety and worry. You know, it's going to cause a lot of worry. But something is being hot. It's exposing something that is going to cause anxiety and worry. Let's see if we can get clarification. I got Alicia's deck, Alicia, Ashley's deck cut into two halves because it is quite thick. Okay, the chariot, caregiver, medical staff. Somebody who was taking care of business, who was supposed to take care of the country, or take care of their own. Um, greed. 
somebody who is taking care of business, trying to take care of the world. Somebody's going to try to step up and, t and act like they're going to take care of the problems, the world's problems or the co net country's problems. <clears throat> but there is a motivation of greed behind that. And people are not working together, they're not working together, or there could be a, co oh, a collaboration behind the scenes. 3D portal in the reverse. The door of opportunity closing. Not going through that portal. Political. This is politically motivated, obviously. But there is a political portal of change. A portal transports. There's transportation. Greed. I'm taking care, I'm going to take care of the nation, of the nation's needs, the nation's problems. We have a transportation issue. I'm wondering if this has to do with gas prices. Does this have anything to do with gas prices? Cult, the elite. There is an elite cult in charge. Disguised as a caregiver. Political cult disguised as a caregiver who has who is portraying themselves as wanting to take care of the problems we've got the answer here's what we are going to do but they don't step through that portal they don't step through that and whatever this is transportation issues natural causes it makes me wonder if there's going to be oh, a domino effect it's going to be one thing that it, and I, I want to say it involves transportation. I'm feeling very much like gas prices or gasoline. People can't travel. People can't get to work. And that it's like a domino effect. First, you know, we're going to have problems with transportation. I think of the electric vehicles. I'm just saying. But gas prices going up is the domino effect that... People are not going to be able to go to work. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. Working as a team. Working in a workplace. People are not going to be able to go to work because of transportation. They can't afford it. Or there's some kind of transportation issue. Gas prices is what came to mind. It's the domino that is going to kick over into, spill over into other things. Other things of control. And yes, we do have something to worry about here. The star, center stage. This is reminding me, like I said, this is not just limited to the United States. But what happens here, and I feel this is the United States, it's going to have a global effect. And we have somebody who's the star of the show. I want to get the other half of the deck for this one. Delays in the reverse. We're moving forward with our plans. We've delayed things. We've put things off. Um, so, and yeah, I'm sorry, that was my son texting me about his bro girlfriend's birthday gift. Anyhow, delays in the reverse not delayed something that was put off no longer being delayed exposed stock followed being exposed not delays in ex There are delays because there's something hidden about stalking here. 
people ca secretly behind the scenes, people looking at a particular individual associated with this political cult that that's interesting. There's something that could be exposed, but, it's not, but there's delays in doing that. The delays that they may have upright is showing me delaying exposing something. In the reverse, it's like the delay is over and somebody who had been hidden is going to come out and expose something and bring something to light in the sun. That's exposure. I'm, I'm hearing a whistleblower. School. Learning. School. We are going to learn of something here. What are we learning? We are learning about somebody who has escaped judgment. The pieces are coming together. Dismemberment in the reverse is something coming back together. Somebody that, I don't want to say, I don't feel like that they were on the run. But they kind of, they've escaped public ridicule. They've, ex they've been escaping exposure of their part, but the pieces are going to start falling into place. They're, it's going to all come together. And, and there is worry and concern over this. I'm going to go back to this deck, this side. What is this worry and this concern? What is this worry and concern? Wow. Okay, we had a bunch pop out. Kidnapped, hands tied. Somebody's hands no longer tied. Caught in the reverse. That's like freedom. Worried about getting caught and, and their hands getting tied. Right now, they haven't been caught yet. There is, their hands aren't tied. That is freedom. Successfully eluding the public and eluding law enforcement. Unavoidable, but this here, man-made disaster avoidable in the reverse is the inevitable is unavoidable at this point. There is going to be exposure of a conspiracy about a political cult. Let me ask this. Is it too late to stop this? It, this says it's unavoidable what is to come. Somebody is going to come out of the woodwork. There's going to be an exposure. But it feels like, is it going to be too late to do anything about this? Ten of, ten of wands in the reverse. Dropping the burden. So somebody's going to drop the burden that they've been carrying. They, somebody has some kind of knowledge, inside knowledge, about a queen of wands. Queen of wands in the reverse. The queen of wands in the reverse is somebody who lacks integrity. She is very motivated, selfish, um, brings on five of swords type of vibes. Somebody knows something about a female. Yesterday, we had a female in power. This female gets in power, then the world as we know it is going to change. But somebody holds the key here of inside information on this female who lacks integrity, who is dishonest, 
She's ruthless. What else can you tell me about this female? What can you tell me about this female? Eight of, eight of Pentacles in the reverse. And Eight of Wands in the reverse. That is working... Working on a craft in the reverse is not working, not putting the energy in. Eight of Wands, a dead stop. She is ruthless in the fact that it's like the working class not moving forward. Can you clarify this? About this Queen of Wands with the Eight of Pentacles. Oh, shit. Allegedly speaking, embezzlement, stealing of money, riot. Okay. There, could, there is going to be an uprising. Probably going to be riots over her getting into office. But her causing riots and embezzling money uh, political scheme, exposure, money, greed. Are you saying, because I'm picking something up here, are you saying that this woman who has the potential to be in power and changing life as we know it, is there an exposure of inappropriate distribution of funds such as like campaign money something about I'm hearing something of being aliens on the outside foreign oh my god water in the reverse on land a foreign land a foreign land, and I'm going to say across water. Somebody oversees inappropriately funding something for her, this woman, maybe her campaign. Um, ancestors and a opposite of angels. Uh, foreign is not somebody she knows. Um, but somebody new aligning with her wow speechless okay let's go back to the tarot how is life going to change how if she gets in office how is life going to change if she gets in office how is life going to change Page of Wands in the reverse. Bad news. Um, bad news. No Communi The news is going to hit hard. Six of Wands, a lack of, lack of victory. We're going to get knocked down. I just heard freedom of speech. King of Wands in the reverse. Ego. Tyrant. Dictatorship. There's a reason why I was called to use this Russian deck.
this is a warning. Judgment Day. Anybody who tries to speak out against this woman is going to be facing some sort of judgment. The fool in the reverse over us or the voters, whomever, making an unwise choice by electing her into office. Um, if she is elected, um, you know, I saw lost votes and stuff. There is some sinister shit going on. And there is a partnership with an organization in the community. Well, oh my God, this is a couple. King and Queen of Swords. This is leadership. This is law enforcement. Judges. Uh, law enforcement. Cold. No emotions. This is a power couple here. We got that two of cups. That could that are very tightly close together. This could be a husband and wife team. Life as we know it is we're losing our freedom of speech. We are going to be under very tight rule. Nine of Wands. History repeating. Cards are saying, get prepared. We've got nine of pentacles in the reverse, losing our independence. That's how life is going to change. The United States no longer being a free country. No longer being able to speak and do as you wish. And there is the Two of Cups, King of Queen of Swords. This is a partnership. Most likely, especially with the Two of Cups and the Two of the same suit here, a very cold relationship. Partners, potentially husband and wife. And I know a lot of people are looking at, and you're thinking Kamala. I think there's going to be a surprise right before the election. Need I say more? Let's just ask. Let's um, let's do this. I'm going to switch decks around a little bit. What's going to happen around election time? Low vibrational perversion. Low vibes. Underhandedness. Perversion. Of money per. Wow. That perversion is something sickening happening. Fake AI. AI being used. 
to create some kind of an illusion that is very perverted, very twisted. Psychic abilities, intuition. That is, th I'm feeling this has been predicted. I am seeing on Nostradamus's Nostradamus. I just saw him, and it's not over. This is not the final ending. Health issues in the reverse. Fake health issues, biological, chemical, scientific. To gain a sense of control. And this, the story, this is saying the story doesn't stop there. There's going to be some kind of something perceived as a health issue. Remember this caregiver, medical staff. Now this is kind of making sense. It's hidden health issues that is created by chemistry or scientific biology. This is something that is going to be made by this elite political cult group. Truth, there's my confirmation. Folks, that's my confirmation I need that I'm on the right track. And this is where I'm dropping the mic.